Hi, it's Kaylee and this is Nick and we're from the Chef Bro Family YouTube channel. Uh, we got in our Keens 7S Plus four passenger uh, wagon stroller and I'm very excited. We've, I've been wanting to upgrade for a little bit and since we have three kiddos that we can't fit into our double stroller so we end up having to take three strollers or we have to baby wear, which I enjoy doing, but it's hard when it's hot. Um, so now we can have all three kids in one stroller that is, you know, rated to be like pretty all-terrain So we should be able to take a lot of places with us um, So we are going to unbox this. this is exactly how it arrived. We just got it today uh, We're gonna um, speed through taking it out and then we're gonna um, hopefully go through the process of putting it together <laughs> for the Keens 7S Plus uh, quad stroller wagon. We have the all-terrain front and rear wheels, the all-terrain locking rear axle, the snack tray that goes in the center when it's up. We have the cell phone holder and cup holder. And then we have the storage travel cover. The actual stroller. And then we have the tread plate cover because the tread plates actually come off completely and have their own storage bag. And then we have the canopy and the canopy bag. And the canopy bag, when it's broken down, actually can strap to the handle of the stroller, which is very convenient. Okay, here we're going to go through a little bit of a closer look on the stroller wagon. It's the canopy, which the sides, yes, unzip. And I actually believe that it has, so it has a nice mesh top. Let some air flow in there when you have the sides down. The sides are actually held up, they're rolled up and kept 
with the little strap. And I really like that it um, hides it. You can't actually see that from the outside. This is the snack tray. It has cup holders on the sides, which are nice. So it's pretty sturdy. There are little pockets on the inside of it as well. That's with the, the foot tread down. And then, yep, the brake. So a cup holder is actually big enough to hold an iPhone 13 Pro. Uh, it won't hold the Max, but it'll hold a 13 anyways. Fits really well. Yeah, very sturdy. I'm actually pretty impressed with this cup holder. The handles are nice. This looks like it's the only spot that it locks into, which took me a second to um, realize that. I was trying to lock the other side. The cooler bag, which one of the coolest features that I liked about this um, that I saw when looking into this was that this opens on the bottom here and it's a mesh bottom, and so you can put like shoes, like sandy shoes or dirty clothes or a towel or something down here, and it's not gonna get everything dirty. I think that's a really like, well thought out feature. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna go over our initial reaction to this um, stroller wagon, and I, Already, I'm pretty impressed. I mean, it does have a high price tag. I think we paid, um, with a military discount, we paid almost 600 uh, for it. But, I mean, the handles I feel great. I really like the cooler bag. The wheels are bigger than I thought they were gonna be. Um, I love that the snack tray comes with it and that it comes stock with it. That's great. You don't have to like pay $50 to have a snack tray. Um, I like that they have they have the quality control um, like tag on here. I like that the um, straps for the the side panels are like hidden in here. I think that's really nice. It makes it look just you know nicer. Um, it looks like there's tons of storage, and I love that too. Uh, one thing I really like is that the. Um Canopy it just drops right down. These uh, supports they just drop right down to help keep them safe for a long time. I am a little concerned with my kids. They like to climb. I'm worried what's gonna happen when they pull up on this here and wrench down on it. Uh, but I guess we'll get there when we get there. Um, it does seem like it's a little flexible here, so I'm not sure what's gonna happen when that day comes. Uh, I'm not impressed with the zippers on here. I thought that for the cost that these zippers would be. Um, a little better, not getting caught up on here. Um, I understand there might be some braking we got to do, maybe put some wax on to it or something, but uh, for a cooler, uh, I understand it's not a Yeti either, but I thought maybe you could do a little better on the, on the zippers. Yeah, so, any other thoughts? Feels sturdy. I yeah, think we'll get off road with them just fine. Uh, Compared to some of the strollers we've had, you know, it feels really sturdy with that. It's very, it's, it's heavy. Uh, so I understand having two handles on there. Um, wouldn't be want something you want to go off road just by yourself with three kids. You definitely would need a partner, but it'll do it. Yeah, we're gonna um, test it out, see how it goes on our trip, and we'll do a follow up video of our pros and cons and, you know, how it's going. So stay tuned for that. Um, like and subscribe if you want to see more. We'll be sharing more of our uh, products for our camping, our trip, our kids, um, everything as we go. Uh, if you don't know, this is our the Shepherd Family YouTube channel, and we are in the middle of traveling from North Carolina to Alaska. We are driving about 5,000 miles. Yeah, we have three kids, one dog, and we're pulling a trailer, and we're tent camping the whole way. So journey with us. Check it out.